What's up everyone, it's Liz. Today, I'm gonna show you how to reclassify transactions in the new QuickBooks Online layout. So if you've ever had a situation where maybe you accidentally put a certain amount of expenses or transactions into one account and you need to easily move them to another, I can show you how to do that quickly. We could do a hundred of them in literally 30 seconds. So let's get started. <music> In QuickBooks, what we're going to do is we're going to head on over here to the top where it says My Menu. And I'm going to scroll down under Tools, and you're going to see this little option right here that says Reclassify Transactions, and we're going to click on this. So the first thing I want to determine when I get on this screen is what report do these accounts show up on? Is it on the profit and loss or the balance sheet? I'm going to select one of those, and then the next thing is what is my date range? So maybe I want to go all the way back to January 1st to July 31st. And it's going to pull all the transactions from that point. Now I'm going to select here and I'm going to find this particular category, right? Ask owner. So right now I have a bunch of transactions sitting here. So I'm going to minimize this. And let's say, for example, all of the checks I want to move to a different category. I could select this box at the top and it will select all 40 lines that are shown. You can also narrow it down by, let's say, check or bill. If you have a particular customer or vendor, you could select it as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select these. And if there's any checks that maybe I don't want to include, I can uncheck them. Now from here, all I'm going to do is click this green button that says reclassify and I can change the account. Once I select the account and I click apply, it's going to move all of those items from that ask account to job supplies. So now if I were to go in here, I would see that all of the checks were moved from the ask account to the job materials account. And that is how easy it is to move hundreds of transactions that were sitting in the wrong account. And that's it. If you want to learn how to master the new QuickBooks Online layout and manage your business financials with confidence, make sure that you check out the course that I created just for you. I walk you through everything step by step from how to set up your accounts to doing your bank reconciliations and reports to how to utilize AI in QuickBooks Online and automating your bookkeeping so that you're not spending hours every week doing it. I show you how to do that from beginning to end. So make sure that you check out the link in my description. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more helpful tips and tricks. Until next time, ciao.